Buenos días. been a busy day with work. What am I going to vlog about today? Well, I've had a pretty good response so far from my BC Wine Challenge video that I posted yesterday. A lot of people have enjoyed the video. I'm glad that's going over well. Uh, if you didn't see yesterday's video, I'll put a little pop-up link. I can't remember which side of the... over here, here, up there somewhere. So it'll be up there if you want to watch yesterday's vlog. I had a lot of fun making that one. Tomorrow, uh, We have to take Miss Bailey to the vet tomorrow. We have to go make sure you never have babies. Last night, Caitlin and I went off to uh, Walmart um, to go buy some baby clothes. Uh, I guess when dogs go in for the surgery, they come up with a comb on their head so they don't lick the stitches off. But um, someone I know suggested that instead of wearing the cone, just to put a little onesie on her. So we went out last night and bought some onesies. Girl puppy, and Caitlin picked out two blues and a pink. So we'll put these on her. And uh, hopefully that stops her from licking her stitches. Lick. Okay, way better than a cone. So tonight we'll give little Miss Bailey a bath and uh, get her all clean and prepped for the surgery tomorrow. If they drop her off first thing in the morning, the previous dog that we had before Bailey, uh, his name was Dexter. When we got him, he was already fixed. We didn't get him as a puppy, we adopted him when he was about a year and a half old. So he was already fixed. So we've never gone through anything like this. So I don't know what to expect tomorrow. Um, I've been told that we just drop her off at about 8.30 in the morning, and then they'll call us later in the afternoon. We have to go pick her up. I don't know if she's gonna be groggy or what it's going to entail or what she's gonna be like, but uh, yeah, I think she'll be all right. So I have a question for you. I have two colleagues of mine that are coming up with work anniversaries in early March, and I don't have any ideas on what to get them. I've scoured the internet and I've, I've looked around at the local mall to find some creative anniversary colleague gift ideas, but I'm kind of fresh out. So um i'll ask you if you have any cool ideas or if you've received or given any cool uh gift ideas for colleagues work anniversaries put it in the comments below uh i'll get notifications if you comment below uh on this youtube video so if you have any ideas for me uh, just put it down below i could really use some help i'm fresh out of ideas and uh it's for two male colleagues middle-aged so if you got any great ideas, again, please put it in the comments below and I'd really appreciate the help. Thanks. I thought I'd throw in the vlog too, just a quick little update on how my YouTube channel is doing. Here, have a look. Uh, including yesterday's post here of the BC Wine Challenge, which was vlog 34, so I've done 34 videos. Um, all my videos have been watched 573 times, which is pretty cool. Thank you for that. And so far you guys have wasted 1,764 minutes of your time watching my video. So thanks again for that. I really appreciate it. So far my most popular video, which has 32 views, which is pretty good for me right now, is Kaylin's vlog.
message received. She'll start doing my vlog for me. Or maybe she can start her own. So that's all I really got for now. Um, if the vlog ends suddenly right now, then you know my life was kind of boring tonight. <laughs>